Hey guys, this is just my uh, voiceover of the FIDM video. So I've got a close-up in 4K of the gloves and the arms. You can see rubber, plastic, plastic, rubber, 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 plastic, plastic, plastic. As I discussed earlier in the video. Uh, you can also see this little bit of vinyl sticking out on the back. Uh, that's just a dressing issue as I just try and get around the back of the costume. So you can see there's a fixing on the top back of the yoke. And we'll just head around the, the other side. You can see the velcro closure on the side there. And the vent details on the back, which look like a separate cast piece uh, in there as well. Uh, on this video I've just uh, had a look up under the lip of the top. It may be hard to see, but there is some detail in there. And then I've just done a, a close-up on the weapon, so we can have a, a review of that. I don't think this is the stunt one, because it doesn't look like it's split. There's a bit of fish wire there on the centre, but it, it, I don't think this is the split version. Um, you can see obviously the vinyl uh, coated belt. I've taken some flash photos, you can actually see the fabric texture of the vinyl underneath. Uh, and also the chest pieces here you can see. Got some nice pictures of the neck as well. You can see those nice eye hole grills. So yeah, this is another video where I've tried to get uh, a video of that top detail, which is quite hard. There's some pips and dots. Uh, and then some more close up on the wrist. Just so you guys can see that rubber. So you can see the transition between uh, these three being rubber and the next one being quite a, a high gloss, high shore plastic. Yeah, quite happy with that. It's good results. I'm just trying to get some views on the back closure on here. Uh, it was quite hard to do. I had it on a, a three foot selfie stick. So over here you can see the, the Velcro closure on the back right hip for the wearer. And those panels and vents again. You also see the neck, neck seal goes really high up. Uh, I'm just trying to see over the top of that lip to see what we can see. It looks to be the same as the first order, uh, which is pretty cool. Uh, the interesting detail you can see under here is the backs actually seems to be made out of three pieces. Um, that second shelf appears to be uh, a whole separate layer that's been glued together on the back. As you can see, a black gap straight through, uh, so it doesn't seem like it's connected as a single piece here. So that's quite interesting. So we've got a few other close-ups here. You can see the um, the gloves seem to go really, really high up. Um, there's a close-up on this neck fabric here. You can see the texture nicely. Uh, I've changed the colour slightly here so you can see the details in the helmet and the next one, just to see the gloves go really, really far up inside there. I don't think that's necessary. And then the, uh, the zigzag stitch on the gloves. And obviously some more texture on that neck piece, which is really nice, it's quite subtle. And uh, just a close up on that uh, wool front, the twill. Last shot, you can see this bracket on the shoulder piece for holding the shoulder bells. And just a close up on the uh, extra grill detail here. 